Hello, in this video we are going to define a bijection. So let's go ahead and do it. So definition. You know, let's uh let let's let's do it differently. Let's let's define bijection uh, a different way. So let's do it like this. So let f from a to b be a function. And let's just kind of define it in a more compound way. Most people will say um, a function f is bijective if it's uh, one to one and onto, which is what we're going to do, except let's just do it all at once. So we say f is bijective just to save time. If, because I don't want to just say, oh, it's bijective if it's one to one and onto. So let me show you what that means. So we, we say f is bijective if. One um, for any x, y, and a, f of x equals f of y implies x equals y. This is uh, this is saying that f is injective or f is one to one, okay? Or injective. Another word is injective. Two. For any uh, little y in capital B, uh, there exists uh, a little x in capital A, such that f of x equals y. And this is just saying f is onto, no big deal, or it's rejective. Very nice. Okay, so we have those. We have those two things, uh, and that's it. Right? <laughs> that's what it means to be. Uh, bijective, it means it's injective and surjective, or one to one and on two, same thing. And it's also called a one to one correspondence. You can say f is a is a one to one. This is I've seen this before in some some books. You see this. I hope it's been helpful. Take care.